The trigger is used to fire your nail gun. When the plastic trigger is depressed, it contacts the trigger valve, which fires the gun. Most problems with the trigger are the result of accidental damage, such as dropping the gun. Replacing the trigger is a repair that you can do yourself, and I'm going to show you how. Hi, I'm Mark Soja. Do-it-yourself repairs like these are easier than you might think. From lawn machines to cordless drills, kitchen mixers, outdoor grills, our how-to videos walk you through each repair from start to finish. So doing it yourself means never having to do it alone. Let's get started. I'll begin by removing the magazine. Now remove the nose piece. Now I'll remove the safety linkage and the trigger. and I'll separate the trigger from the safety. The contact lever is secured to the trigger with a roll pin. I'll go ahead and remove it. Now I can replace the trigger. Now I'll place the contact lever inside the trigger and secure it with the roll pin. I'll use my punch to align the two parts. Now reinstall the trigger to the safety. I'll place the spring on the post on the safety, align the post on the trigger with the spring, and snap the trigger into the safety. Now this assembly can go back into the gun. Now reassemble the safety. I'll make sure the small o-ring for the air feed to the piston is in place and then reinstall the nose piece. I'll secure the nose piece with the screws and bracket. And I'll install the safety spring and the cover. and finish up by reinstalling the magazine. And now you can replace the trigger on your nail gun. Be sure to check back often for new videos and expert advice. If you found this video helpful, give us a thumbs up 